<clears throat> Aliens. <laughs> Good evening and welcome back to the Adams Family Mystery Mansion. And as you can tell, we are now in the kookiest month of the year. Halloween, baby. And hopefully this one is a little bit better than what happened uh, last year. And I think it is, depending on how it looks. So before we jump into the reveal of it, let's go ahead and show off this. Unhappy new month, players. Ready for the spookiest month of the year? Oh yeah. And of course we got Cousin It just jamming up and down. I guess I don't know where they got this from, but they have archives of stuff and all that nature, but yeah. So anyways, if you've seen my part three to the video um, of the last event, you may have noticed that we ended up getting, or I ended up getting, this teaser of a fear wand. And of course, we also got this as the main teaser from the post, basically showing some sort of spooky sci-fi type of thing. And sure enough, they ended up revealing what exactly that is, and I figured instead of just saying what it is, let me just show you what it is, because they got you a video this time around. Full widescreen this time. That's right, we have an alien invasion. Aliens attack is this year's Halloween event. And, uh, how, wow, I don't know what to say about this. This is going to get a lot more spookier than I expected, but hey, nothing too bad about that. Not bad at all. So, before we go into it and do our usual thing, let's go ahead and dive into the game as we take a look into, uh, let's just put it this way, um, Right, let's just go ahead and dive into the game and talk about this uh, this event, as it were. So, let's see the email that came with this update. It's official. Spooky season has begun. <laughs> Alright, the alien attack event has just begun. So let's take a look. The biggest event ever is here. It better be. I swear, it better be good. You're hyping this up, man. Alright, let's read this here. An evil race of spooky aliens has invaded Earth to steal all the Halloween candy! The Adams Family will defend the mansion and their candy from the evil Space Emperor using every trick and cheat at their disposal. I wouldn't have it any other way. That's about it. Alright, what's new? Ooh, look at all them stuff there. Alright, so here it is. We have one new seasonal cookie box with rewards from the alien attack event. Ten new seasonal outfits such as Alien Emperor Costume Fester, Space Warrior Wednesday, and Neon Alien Costume Grandma. Seventeen new decorations such as the Pumpkin UFO, the Anti-Alien Turret, and the Pumpkin Dragon. Pumpkin Dragon, okay. Wow, okay, they're going all out with the pumpkins, aren't they? Oh well, nothing says Halloween like jack-o'-lanterns. Anyways, ten new animations such as Rain Fire, Alien Abduction, and Moonwalk. Ten new quests, four new mini-events. One new catacomb level, one new assimilation level, and that's it. <laughs> and uh, it's a Halloween celebration from out of this world. And of course, here's a preview of the mansion that they tease, so you get a good idea what that looks like there. So yeah, that's about it for here. So let's go back into the, ma um, you know, the, the story thing. I, I don't know what, At the beginning of the th video? God, why am I having trouble with this? So here's the uh, no, patch notes that came with in the Apple's eye store, just so you get a good idea with the full length of thing. Like I said, Apple does, uh, Google does the same thing, but they're a little bit more shorter, like Twitter, in the sense of their amount of words you can put, so it's a little bit limited. But uh, you might be curious also, uh, this also, one thing that came with the app, uh, Google stuff is that they were actually starting to show event stuff now, which is great. So now I can tell you that this update, according to this, will end exactly on November 1st. So we have up until Halloween night in order to get this done, and then the beginning of November, which is probably in the morning whenever they can start this off, basically be done. So it's about four weeks give or take, which is a little bit longer than the three weeks we've been expected to do for a while. 
So that's nice. Anyways, we got that going on there. There's also something else. Uh, we also have this picture here, which is um, advertising the gold pass, because of course they had to. They had to advertise the gold pass, because, you know, it wouldn't be Adams without it. Although, yeah, I guess they're starting to do this a lot more now, every time. I, I'm not sure why. I guess it's just something to go, hey, you want all the prizes? Get the gold pass, at least. So there's that. And of course, before we end it, here's the thumbnail for the app. So we got Wednesday and her getup, and of course the invasion of the little spooky UFP flying around. That being unidentified flying pumpkin, but I digress. But yeah, anyways. So we're going to jump right into the game where we last left off, which was back at the 24th of September. As we, like, immediately right after we ended there, we're going back into this game. So, let's just dive in and see what past me had to say. It's Halloween time. <laughs> Hello, welcome to part one to whatever this Halloween special is. And I have been recording, uh, actually, just a few minutes ago, finished the last part. And this is the continuation of this part. So, as you can see, I have not done this yet, which I will show off once I'm done reason I'm recording this is because I want to show you what I ended up moving certain things around. I have basically hide some things, right? So we have our golem pet here. You know, he's a, he's part of the guards, as you can see. But uh, that's not the only thing I've done. I've moved some things around, and I've decided to give the plushies to certain characters. Like, I thought this one would fit for Wednesday for some reason. And yes, I also moved the nightmare demons to certain beds. I had to keep uh, the clown bed because why not? Because that's the only other bed I kept because I actually liked it. I gave him the bat because I figured it would match him. Uh, Fester, I gave the snake because, you know, there's an animation with the snake, I believe, for that. Oh, and by the way, uh, do you like my crow army? Yeah, uh, I decided to put this here because I figured... You know, the event area is split, like, you know, a line to cross off, so this here is going to be reserved for events. So these crow boys are basically standing guard, but there's a little opening here so characters can walk in and out. So they're not totally blocked off, so they can still get access to the other room. It's just more or less a visual thing. And as you can see, this one's fighting for dominance over here. Righty, so anyways... We got that going on here. Uh, right. So we go over here to it, and we gave him the scorpion, because eh, why not? Uh, Orphelia's bed, we gave that there. We gave the spider to the couple. And as you can also see, I put the bed right here. And the reason I did that was because, you know, we're going to have Morticia's animation, so figured, most likely. So I figured put it close to the bed so yeah although this is getting claustrophobic oh yeah and i put that there so although this is getting claustrophobic i've i've made things work i put the bubbly over here so yeah and everything else i kind of just archived because why not also uh if you probably notice i have how many crow boys i have like seven i believe right let's just see this yeah wow okay <laughs> seven i have seven more so I, I don't want to get rid of them because I I just like these plushies and it gives me a reminder of Gale and the crows that keep on memeing at me. So hopefully this Halloween update is good. I've heard it's supposed to be big. I have yet not known what exactly the theme is, but you probably saw part three and found out what it is. Or um, basically the beginning of this part, you pretty much know what it is. But during the recording, which is still in September... I have yet not know what it is because I have not gotten a hint as far as what to expect. But I'm hoping we get a lot of Halloween stuff like we did back in 20, uh, 2021. No, 2020. Yeah, 2020. Hopefully we get a lot more stuff like that. Not so much the movie promotion. And hopefully it's very Halloween-y. And like I said before, my plan is to get this going. So wish me luck on that. It'll be a little while, but... At least we're going to be focusing on this before we move on to, say, Assimilation and the new area. I want to get the new area unlocked first, so wish me luck. Hey, guess who's back? It's me, of course. Before we do what we were supposed to be doing, 
Let me go ahead and click this, do that, hand it in, so that way I can get closer to skins, because I had enough stuff to do stuff. Alright, let's click on Pugsley, thank you, Morticia, and finally Gomez. There. There we go. Now then, let's get me my 20 thingies. There you go. Look at that. Yeah. Now that is something. Also, that's a weird glitch with his hat just disappearing at one point. Nice, uh, interesting models, I guess. Right, well, that's it for now. I have not gotten any information yet for Halloween as of the recording of this, so... Hopefully I'll come back once I know. All right. Big indeed. Wow. Okay. So he just sent me the image in question, which is this little dinky thing. Like um, one of the craftables most likely for sure. But when I looked at it, immediately I was like, aliens. <laughs> outer space. We have an outer space event going on for Halloween. Wow. And apparently there's a lot of surprises and a lot of big things going on. So I'm, I'm, hey, you're, you're hyping me up, Juan. Just make sure I, I better be up there. I swear. God, I just, I'm, I'm only just hoping, man, that uh, this turns out well. Because, um, you know, <laughs> God, um, <laughs> I'm, I'm speechless. So, this this has potential to be pretty good, but I have to see exactly what happens. So, color me intrigued. I guess this thing is going to call up aliens. Because what else is it going to be? Well, I'm looking forward to it. You know what would be interesting is that on October the 17th, I would be a year exactly since I got my community post. And it's interesting that at this time, I've actually gotten myself, um, well, what do you call it? A thousand subscribers, which is a, a big milestone, which I've probably already talked about at some point. But that's not the only thing. The only, the other thing is that now I can have, uh, money. <laughs> uh, you might have already noticed it right now with the videos that they have some ads on them. I've talked about it with other games like Goosebumps, but my whole purpose with these is that they're hopefully not going to be intrusive. You might have already started to see them newer videos now being uploaded in October. They are, if if it's longer for a certain period, there's an ad in the middle. So it's like every 30, an hour is like within the half, half of like half of the videos, basically an ad in there. And then if it's longer than an hour, which I tend not to want to do, but if it is, then there'll be two ads. <laughs> but again, I do a fade in, fade out, so hopefully it's not too intrusive. Because I always hate when ads just come out of nowhere and interrupt the video because it's just so dumb. <sighs> I'm a guy who hates ads, so... And I feel like I have to do it just because YouTube, you know, it, they have to make it on money, right? So... And that's the only unfortunate part about it. But on the plus side, that means more people are more aware that I'm here because they'll start promoting this stuff. So there's that. But yeah, anyways, uh, excited for Halloween. I'm hoping to find out what it will be very soon. And we get to see the theme. So be on the lookout for that. And uh, don't worry, I won't. <laughs> I won't be making this monetary value, you know. I, I promise. Hopefully. Well, today's October 1st, which means Spooky Month is here. That means my character has changed. I'm now in purple background. I've now become a, a scarecrow, and now I'm a living jack-o'-lantern. Glowing and all. Yeah. Which is always fun. But, during this time, too, I wanted to say something. Yes, so it's been a while, as you can see. Give me a normal box, like if it's nothing. But seeing how this is Saturday, we also got Agatha coming here. So let's see what she's offering. So, we have the family reunion, I think number two. 
cool upper corner, family reunion number one. You just get the one corner. Uh, St. Patrick's event, I believe this was the second one? Yeah, I think so. The convertible holiday events, I think this was back for 2020. The personal storm cloud Halloween stories, which, uh, oof. That, that was certainly something. <laughs> Uh, I mean, actually, by the time you see this, the video should be out, so part two should be finishing up, so that's cool. And then the New Year's event for the missile, so that's fun. Yeah, always great to see. Unfortunately, we won't see how she disappears, but eh, who cares. Well, there is a lot of big things going on. The first one is that we got Spooky Month coming back, as as we can expect. And um, as I mentioned before, it seems like it's going to be an alien event. They finally released their teaser, which you probably saw in part three and in the beginning of part one. But this is the first time I actually am seeing it. Not post-edit. And uh, it looks like we're going to get a alien vibe. Like, like, it looked like Jack Skellington in a sense. So immediately I looked at this and I was like, this reminds me so much of Attack of the Jack-O-Lanterns. And I feel like that's pretty much where they're going with this. And I'm, I'm digging it. <laughs> the Halloween tradition, basically from Aliens. I love that. And apparently there's going to be a lot of stuff added to it. Potentially new music. So I'm I'm, I'm expecting the full mile. I want this to blow my socks up. I want this to be the number one event of this year. So you got high hopes. <laughs> and uh, here's the other sad news, but also good news for him. Um, as of the recording of this video... Uh, he's no longer the director to this game, meaning that November is his last technical thing he did for the for this game, which is unfortunate, but it is very nice to see this being a thing. So hopefully we get to see, you know, I'm, I'm excited to see what is coming up for this update in the November, and he's going to still be watching. We're still going to keep contact. But uh, he actually got promoted to, to a new ventures of somewhere else. And, uh, you know, kudos to him. I'm glad to see him. Hopefully it works out well for him. But uh, that means our boy Thomas is coming back. So he'll be doing December. So I'm, I'm thinking the new, a new person will come in January. So I should probably expect something there. Hopefully I get to meet the new person. If I already not met them before. But... Yeah, I'm expected to see a lot more cool stuff. But yeah, expect some things to come around, that's for sure. But yeah, that's that's basically it for this uh this recording. So, lots of stuff to look forward to. Halloween's upon us. Let's uh, you know, ignore this this stairs because it's not really Halloween. But this stuff is, you know, we've got some spooky pumpkins already out and about. So we're going to get more pumpkins, more Halloween goodness. So hopefully by the time I come back, something interesting happens. So stay tuned. Aliens attack. All right. We finally got our uh, thing. Which actually looks pretty cool to tell you the truth. So yeah, as I figured, aliens. So this will be interesting to see how this turns out. But I'm curious. They did. I figured. Oh. Will this be the Halloween music moving forward? Well, man, listen to that. I'm going to have to record this off my off time. But yeah, there you go. Spooky music. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> Alright, well. There you go. So, it'll be interesting to see how this turns out. But yeah, the event won't start just yet, but it will in a minute. Or, you know, by the time I come back. And, um... Yeah. Interesting. But, um... Yeah, I'll be curious to see if any other Halloween stuff gets added in here. I do know that they did add a new level for Catacombs, which I won't know. But they also did something for Assimilation, so it'll be interesting to see with that. But yeah, this update's supposed to be big, so I'm expecting some big things. Music is certainly one of them, but, you know, I want to see decorations. I want to see 
the pumpkin bombs return. So, man, I'm looking forward. Don't disappoint me, man. Well, the update's now live, and uh, I've learned some things about this update, especially that apparently there's something new coming in next week. I don't know what it is, but it's supposed to be a big thing. And then uh, some other stuff, too, as far as uh, things getting added. So, looking forward to seeing that. Also, there's also there's been an addition to the Desires page, which I'm going to show off. So, be back once this is done loading. Alright, we're all done. And, yeah, thanks. Alright, so we're going to take a look at this. Alright, so we got some nice CGI type thing. Oh, nice box. It's looking more like alien stuff. So this um, is the candy basket, and it drops us, I guess, a cosmic lollipop. That's what it is. <coughs> we have four weeks this time around, so that's nice. All right, so let's see what we can get our first items over here. Crashed meteorite. Oh, and somebody died, by the way. I just noticed that. Astronaut suit for Lurch, which is nice. Alright, so... Oh, then we got this. Pumpkin Vader. Got... Wait a minute, look at the face. Is that like a oo face going on there? Does look like it, doesn't it? So you get one, but you can get three if you get the gold pass. So, there's that. We have Pumpkin Spawner. Interesting. Weird. We have alien costume for Cousin It. I feel like I have to say Cousin It instead of just It, because if I don't, then they'll just confuse it with Thing. So, oh god, that is interesting. So first, I'm not talking about the satellite. The satellite is whatever, right? That's cool. But then you go to the pumpkin crawler. It's like this, and then, ooh, spooky. Look at them legs. <laughs> That's actually kind of cool. As far as designs go, a lot of people seem kind of disappointed to be like, oh, I wanted the Halloween tradition. It's like, hey, it could be worse. It could be Halloween stories last year. You don't want that, do you? Yeah, of course you don't. Battery core. So that's this here. Not sure what that's supposed to be for. Space Warrior Parker. So I've got that here. What is this? Space Warrior card. So I think this is a Pugsy card. So if you get the gold stuff, then you unlock it through there. All right, so we got this, which is the power cell. Interesting look, that's for sure. And then we got the centerpiece, which has a more sci-fi um, <laughs> Halloween thing. I don't know why I'm kind of coughing now, but uh, there you go. We have a pumpkin UFO. It is animated, so that's nice. And then we have, what is this? Alien Emperor costume for... I think this is Fester. So it'll be interesting to see what he looks like in there. Because he's kind of like, you know, zoomed in, you probably see him. But for me, I don't know, right? Oh, so you do get a pumpkin crawler. So you get two of them. But you get one of them, like, you can get one early if you get the gold pass, is what I'm trying to say. Got the stairs, which actually looks pretty interesting. I'm looking forward to seeing what that looks like. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Sorry about that. And then we got the final one here, which is the Tex Chandelier, which makes me wonder if it is a costume skin. I guess we'll find out. And the grand prize is... <sighs> of course it has to be Gollum. A spooky Gollum. Woo. Oh, God. Man, you and your Gollums. So the fear one. So that's something I got teased with near the end. So... We'll need forks, cosmic lollipops, spooky bomb. Okay, we got a candy col collector. All right, then we need an alien spaceship, astronaut helmet. Nice, you see a dead guy in there. Adam's family flag. All right, makes sense. Sweetness scanner. Mm hmm. Adam's rocket. Okay. Cosmic Cupcake. And the Spooky Singularity. Alright. Makes sense. 
Let's see the bundles and oh, okay. So the grand prize is count count Pomcula. Oh God. Okay, you and your puns. So let's see this. Nothing for the space gold pass. All right. Space Warrior Pack. Let's see what comes here. Alien Drone. We got Space Warriors for Wednesday. Morticia and Gomez. Alien Tank that looks like a squid monster. Anti-Alien Turret. Another Pumpkin Crawler. I'm not sure if any of these can be bought. Yeah, so it, it, the Pumpkin Invader, yeah. He has he has this uwu face, you know, like the big eyes. And then you do this. Oh, yeah, and then he does the, you know... Ooh, <laughs> it's like one of those things. Event points are these weird jack-o'-lantern UFOs stuff. Interesting. All right. So the items offered is not that bad. All right, let's see this. The Alien Vader pack. So we got Pumpkin Dragon. Why a Pumpkin Dragon? I don't know. Who cares? Spooky Alien costume for um, Socrates, which looks fun. Alien Princess costume, which looks like bubblegum type thing. Neon Alien costume for Ant Sloom. Pumpkin Bot. Interesting. Weird, but okay. Spooky Container. Mm-hmm. Alien Knowledge. Alien Specimen. Alright. Got more Pumpkin Crawlers. So the Pumpkin Crawlers are going to be fun to place down. Pumpkin Invaders too. They look like plushies. Those uwu faces. I'm calling it uwu faces because that's what it is. <laughs> uh, uwu. Like literally. That's the face. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so we got that here. Any decorations? Out and about? No. No Halloween decorations. Really? Oh, I'm disappointed. Come on, man. I showed you that there was a costume for Halloween, but you didn't do that. No, no, no decorations at all. That is a, that is unfortunate, man. Very unfortunate indeed. Uh, because, you know, I guess once I get to Halloween 2020, you'll see what I mean. But there's like decorations here and the bombs were like decorated with pumpkin stuff. But uh, yeah, you know. You know, we get cool music finally, spooky music. I mean, that's that's nice, but still, man. Like, look, no jack-o'-lantern bombs again. Why? I mean, it would be easy. It's like an easy just change, but okay, whatever. I guess screw us then, all right? But it's yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna see all you guys later. I'm gonna see all you guys later. Let me just click on the bomb, please. Thank you. Right. I wonder if I have any enough room for this. I'm gonna I guess I'm gonna have to find out. But um yeah, before we do that, let's see this, the other pack here. So we got Space Warriors. Oh good, it's match three is back. Of course. Alien cookie box, alien vaders. Otherworldly beings, that's what I'm looking for. So what is this? Uh, astronaut costume, cursed bar. Oh hell yeah! Finally, we got stupid costume for <laughs> for Ichabog. This is what I was talking about when I first saw him. I'm just like, you better be spooky. And yeah, there you go. Yep, not disappointed. I can't wait to see exactly how it looks closed up. And we got neon alien costume for Grandma. So at least we got our thing. another golem. Why? Why with the golems? Kind of golem. <laughs> You and your golems. Pumpkin Wrath. Scorpion Pumpkin. More Pumpkin Crawlers. More Pumpkin Invaders. Man, imagine these things being the, like, the things you have to go after. Like, yeah, that's threatening. I want all your candy! <laughs> Literally, that's all they want. So, yeah, and then you got stupid match stuff. You know, because, like, oh, 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 yippee. You know, and then they got this, which is like, don't care. I'm glad they don't longer push the the thing there because really, I just don't care about them anymore. All right, let's see this satellite dish. All right, so we need 
Cosmic Lollipops, which is something I'm gonna have to do. Adam's Family Flag, Fear Wand, Cosmic Cupcake. So you know what, maybe before I do anything, oh yeah, and then there's this, Sophie's here. Cause it's a Tuesday. Oh, look at that. Look at them faces. Ah, right, time to beam you up. You know, all that stuff. And you know what, we should take a picture because this is now year two, right? She's been around here for two years now. She was introduced back in Halloween. So, click. Yes, save a picture. There you go. I don't want to share it because it's going to be shared in the end of the video series. So, yeah. Don't care about that. So, I guess, figured why not go to Sakura thing for now. Let's see, we already seen his costume, which is that. Nice, it's a blue background, so at least I know what color I'm going to have to use for the thing. Uh, so he does the spooky sing um, singularity bat form. Ooh, interesting. I'm a sucker for bats. But I want you to do your dancing. Yeah, okay, I just wanted to see. So, dancing. And let's go to Morticia, because we have that costume, right? That we wanted to do. So let's just see that real quick. Yeah, the Space Warrior one. Alright, let's see this. So we need an alien tank. Rain fire. And get Adam's rocket. So let's see this here. Um, where is it exactly? I'm trying to see what cost... Um, what it, yeah, here it is. How horror. And it gives us poison berries. Nice. Do I think I need her for anything else? What's for two hours, so whatever. I'm going to do that right now. Have her do that. We'll look at the story real quick. And uh, I guess try to see if we can't continue. But the main quest to get to the catacombs. Because you released another episode of Catacombs. And I can't show it off. Apparently it's the mines now. So they moved from doing um, weird uh, things. Um, of wine stuff to now ah yes mining because underground i'll look at you in a minute parker so there's two new things here so one is a chair i guess what is this or is this gonna be the sandalier thing let's see where where is this um it's just a centerpiece all right. Oh, so you can buy these. Interesting. Good to know. So you can buy these if you want, and they don't cost too much, I guess. But still, that's like, ooh. And of course, you can get your hand candy baskets if you want, but, uh, nah. Nah. <laughs> nah. By, by the looks of things, I'm going to get n enough of these just fine. All right. So we don't have to worry too much about that. Actually... I have one in there, don't I? No. I thought I had one to put down. Or do I have to unlock it first? Yeah, I guess I have to unlock it first. But you start the event with just 70, 750 coins, so that's nice. Alright. Um, we should probably look at uh, the co I guess... What should I do? Okay, you know what? Let's just do this. Yeah, so now we have this here. So this is interesting because now... They switched it. So now there's two options. The one's for events. The other one's for, you know, this. Which is great. Because now we don't have to confuse the two. So that's great. So now we can just sell stuff off without having to worry so much about that things. That's nice. Oh yeah, and then we have this here. Nice alien attack. You know, let's just do one. Oh, so they didn't even change. Oh my god. So they didn't even change for Halloween at all. Like the last one they did like spooky, you know, like um, a spooky one back in 2020 and then 2021. Like last year, the stupid uh, one that I'm not too proud of, <laughs> as you'll see. Um, that that apparently um, has a has a thing. But um, no, not not. Uh, <laughs> Not this year. You know, we have alien stuff. You could have just went back to Halloween stuff. Like, again, I showed, hey, look, we got some stuff here. But nah, no. Nah. Nah. Don't need it. 
Like, like, come on, man. Come on. Come on. <laughs> uh, could have done it better, but no. All right, I need to do this clear stuff. All right, so I guess. Ah. Uh. There, finally, I did it. Yay! Can open the pumpkin box. Fantastic. Good. That's the only one you're gonna get. Of me playing puzzles. Oh, really? I didn't get to... Wow, okay, it didn't give me a whole lot. Oh, I just saw a crow there. Alright, well, this is the box. Nice, nice looking opening. It looks bigger than it was before, but that's weird. All right. Ah, uh, the crow's gone. Dang it. I knew it. I should have waited. Oh, uh, you know what? I got myself a lollipop and I probably shouldn't have done that. Because it'd be like, ah, get your, put the lollipop down. You know. Oh, well. So I need some of the lollipops here. So I need to craft one of these, which is easy. This one I need. Okay, so let me just see this. Fear wands is, yeah, we need two of the forks. And then we need flags, which is like, okay, so I guess I need to get capes. Does somebody drop? No, they don't. I, I was going to say that somebody dropped me capes, but no, I have to get it through, you know, this. So I guess I have to do that now before I forget. Right, so we got that going on here. So, we should probably look at the characters. I'm just trying to debate what to do here. All right, open up a golden box. Yeah, I'm just being random right now. So, um, let's see, because we need to do some stuff, right? You know what, let's look at the other place. So let's just go to, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm going all over the place. Let's just go to assimilation first. So, uh, see you over there. Yeah, and to no one's surprise, it's not even anything spooky. Oh, nice. So we got Crocodile Pack. So I guess this is for the level upgrade thing that we got here. That's nice. So apparently there's supposed to be a new feature coming next week. I don't know what it is exactly, but I guess we're going to find out um, together. Oh yeah, there's no cookie box because of course there isn't. As you can see, I haven't touched this area because of, you know wanting to save up on things oh nice so this is the hospital episode coming up so that's going to be interesting and i think there apparently there's costumes now so yeah so there's supposed to be new cost i think there's new costumes but i might be mistaken yeah there is so and then we have wednesday who is available so i need plague doctor interesting so to see this here so yeah so that's the only do, 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 do. so that we already know fester yeah 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 i'm gonna say that's the only one so it's just those two new ones so that's interesting Radio, so that's about it. Uh, maybe we can go to the next door neighbors just to see if they've added the new features over there. All right, so we're new here. So let's just see anything to add. It doesn't look like they added anything as far as new stuff goes that I can see. So they have yet to change this. So might be something I have to look at in the near future. But uh, for now, nothing. Uh, we, you know, we should probably look at the, uh, before we go to the mansion, let's go back to simulation and look at the new items in the inventory. Right, so now we're back here. So let's just see this real quick. So no new buildings. Uh, uh decorations, I'm sure there will be. Yeah, there is. So there's hospital ambulance, hospital screen, pharmacy, morgue, mental asylum, helicopter, x-ray booth. Definite, legit, um, I don't know what it is supposed to be. Factory. <laughs> Nothing there for suppliers. Premium. We have one new one, which is a skeletal test subject. All right, cool. All right, let's go back to the mansion and see if we can go to the neighbors.
Actually, you know what? Let me just jump over to the neighbors to see what they're up to. Yeah, so they have yet to update this, so that's going to be something I'm going to have to look at a little bit later on in the event. What I probably am going to do, or what I probably did, was I showed off what the... Um, if I if I even didn't see this, that means it didn't appear in the assimilation area. However, I'm going to assume there will be a change for this, so I'm going to make sure to put this in here um, after the fact. So, if after this you'll go into the next clip, which is going to be continuing on the thing. However, you should probably see what the assimilation map is. So, I mean, you know, the thing, so... Anyways, here's what the mansion looks like once they finally added. It's finally the next day. And as you can see, the things are here. So, they really did a good job with uh, the decorating and everything like that. So we get a good idea. Like, you know, this, this everything here just looks so cool. And I can't wait to actually... Although, it seems like they have a lot of version so you know like i don't think we get two golems so obviously you know they're using you know they're kind of cheating so you can't really pull off the same thing here unfortunately because they got something going on here oh no that's cute too i can't wait to show that which is the uh actual animation of the little critters and then they just disappear after and of course i have to highlight this thing Got that, got the stair preview, and oh look, we actually have an animation with somebody, so that's interesting. And uh preview of the costume, although he's kind of glitched right now. Um, Alright, I'm kind of curious, do we actually get to see the other... Oh, wow, we also get to see something with uh, Ichabog. So again, a lot of... I'm, I'm just, again, I'm trying to see if there is anything with to do with... um. The, uh, you know, Dallas de los Motos pack that we might get later on. Though, as you can see, there's not a whole lot here, except for the fact that we have, you know, a lot of saucers here. Again, like the saucers, it's cool, though I think we only get the one, right? So again, some previews of stuff to expect. It's actually kind of cool, though. I do like the whole, you know, previews of stuff to go. And I did talk to, uh, you know, um, <laughs> you know, Juan. And um, it's funny how they're like, oh, I wanted to put the uwu faces on there. So, yes, there are uwu faces. <laughs> God. And just thinking about it, looking at it, he's like, you know, uh, it's like, uh, give us candy, uwu. And it's just like, what are you going to do if we don't? It's like, well, I'm going to give you huggy wuggies. It's like, oh, no, not huggy wuggies. That'd be terrifying, especially for the Adams. But yeah, look at this. They have so much here. And then you have the little little invaders. Again, this is so cool with the whole invasion thing going on here. It's just it's just a shame. And like, yeah, they're overpopulating this whole thing. Like, you know, we're never gonna get this big of a thing unless unless after we get it, they end up available for like other purchases, but I doubt it. So there's like a pumpkin over there. I don't know what that's all about. But, um, man, I'm I'm just disappointed. Not too bad, but, you know, you would think Halloween. You would be like, oh, yeah, Halloween, of course. Let's just um, put Halloween decorations up. Nah, nah, let's not do that. Bombs? Nah, let's not do that either. <laughs> uh, well, at least you get to see something here. All right, well, I guess back to uh, the be the main part of the videos anyways. Welcome back. Uh, I just ended up watching a commercial and got myself another one of these. So that's cool. Yay. Yay, I got this one. Yay, I got another box. I've yet to continue with the quest line. <laughs> I've yet to continue with the quest line. I probably am regretting it because it's probably going to be like, Ah, oh, do this thing. And it's just like, no, you didn't do it. You know, you failed. But uh, it's whatever. All right. Uh, so why don't we just look at the? Yeah. You know what? Let's just do the quest line just in case, and then we'll just look at the costumes. 
I can't wait for Halloween this year. I'm gonna eat so much candy that I'll get sick. You don't need a costume, then. What do you mean, sis? I love dressing up. Yeah, just like your costume from last year that you're wearing right now. Just keep chowing down and nature will take care of decorating your clothes. Oh god, I know what you're referring to there now. Great. Under the Nefi Flying Pumpkin. Or UFP. Interesting. Obtain a fork, wool, and the yeah. axe. <laughs> knew it. I knew it. <laughs> yeah, why didn't I wait? But couldn't help it. Alright, well. We got that going, I guess. So... Um, I guess I have to come back later on just to see, yeah, to do this. So we're not going to be finishing part one just yet because I want to move on to this and then see from there. So, you know, we'll just do that then and uh, have some fun with that things. Yeah, we got some pumpkins and whatnot, so that's nice. All right. Nice. We've got some costumes too, so we're slowly upgrading. So let's just go ahead and, um... To just uh, see the costumes exactly. So first, let's go to Gomez. We already see Morticia and Thing, so we already know them. So we got Space Warrior. All right. So, all right. So I got that. So his is Rain Fire. We need an alien tent tank for that. So are they going to do this? Are they allowed to for one area, or do we just you know? What I mean is that can a character go into two? Like, if a character's using something, can they get out of character? Yeah, they can. I just realized that they, they did before with... In the past, so it should be... Fine. Sorry. Again, just... Uh, I have work tonight, and I'm not looking forward to it. Like anybody is. Alright. So, I got that. Hers is anti-alien turret, and it is... Bring them down. Just like Duke Nukem. That's just, you know, that's it. This is Duke Nukem. That's it. Got one scene. All right, whatever. I'm just trying to commentate here. So this is the costume in question that we're going to get the Space Warrior one. We need a pumpkin UFO. Gives us candy collector. And it is alien abduction. Nice. So we already know what happens to him. Let's look at Fester's alien thing. Because I was kind of curious about that. Okay, so that looks weird, but all right. He looks like a Muppet. Also, what's wrong with his head? Yeah, what's what's going on with his head right now? What what is that? Is is he screwed up anywhere else, or is it just that costume? No, it just seems like it's that costume alone. <laughs> I still love the fact that uh, the octopus monster is just frozen. <laughs> oh God. Alright, so... Oh, that's why, because... Oh, God, so his things is glitched there. I don't know why. Oh, God, <laughs> all of his things is glitched. Oh, my God, what's going on? <laughs> Some of this costumes is not working properly. Alright, now, now I want to play Curious. Let's see, so that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. That's also fine. That's not fine. <laughs> so it seems like it seems like anything on his head doesn't work. Yeah, so anything on his head just goes backwards. I mean, that's okay. That's kind of okay. That's also kind of okay. Okay. That's fine. Nothing's glitched there. Neither is that. That. So that's fine. This is broken. <laughs> Oh, and apparently he can't... Apparently that thing's not working now. So, what what's going on here? Yeah, that's fine. That hat's kind of... Oh, God. That's fine, I guess. Octopus is there. Yeah, so it's just... Yeah, it's just for some reason anything with his head just seems to go the opposite way. That's weird. So I don't know what's going on there. What, what, why, why is it glitch? That's weird. And it's not showing now, that's stupid. Even though it's on. Steal children's candy. Alright, I guess that makes sense for him. Great, so, Vester's glitched. That's nice. 
Oh god, so we have neon alien costume for grandma. And it is candy golem, which doesn't show. Or candle golem, sorry, doesn't show up. Cast fire. Alright, so there you got that. Lurch is actually going to be with Ophelia with the Delis de los Mertos. So like last year, uh, there it is. The dead uh, Mirachi. Which is interesting. And we got the astronaut suit. So at least it's up in front this time, which is nice. So Moonwalk, basically, for his animation. And then his other one, I guess, what we're going to find out, is called A Skeletal Mirachi. And it is Shake Those Bones. Okay. And then there's another one with the old family recipe. A study wine bottle. So, does he have a costume for that? I don't think he does. I think it's just an animation he has in the new area. Yeah, he just has a new animation for the new area. Cousin It. Yeah, I'm not mistaking you this time, buddy. Alright, so. Just that. And we need pumpkin spawns. And it's called Panic. Gives us the flag, by the way, so that's nice. If we do ever get him. Parker. Which, uh... You know, the Space Warrior. And she gives us What's This from the Crash Meteorite with a dead guy. Because, of course. Wouldn't be Adams without some, uh, very gory things, right? Kitty, we got the astronaut costume. He does chow time for, his, for a scorpion pumpkin. Alright. Um, <coughs> God. All right, I'm just getting coughing now. Neon alien costume for her. The horror, basically, is what it's called there. Interesting. So some of them are cost. Oh, hold on. Revenge. <laughs> I saw you this time. You're not getting away that easy. All right, so uh, back to where was I? Oh, yes, the... Um, it was going to be Socrates, so let's just see him, Orphelia, and then Ichabog. Alright, so, interesting spooky alien costume. Alien knowledge, we need that. Bypass security. It'll be interesting to see how that turns out. Orphelia, we have the two costumes, which is nice. Electrina. Ah, so just like uh, what Skelly was supposed to be. Basically, Lady Death. Alien princess costume, so... Let's see, alien specimen. We get fascinating for the co for the th animation, and this one's called "Celebrate Death with Family Altar." I think I might know what exactly might be going on there, but we'll see. So, Lurch drops bones, and he she drops the reanimated corpse, which is actually pretty decent because only Lurch can drop that unless you craft it. And then finally, Ichabod with his. Spooky pumpkin curse bird costume. <laughs> Boy. Sorry about that. And it is, uh, let's see, release spooks. All right. And it gives us a lollipop, so it's not that too exciting, but hey, whatever. And then they got uh, Shake It Off, so he has something going on for, uh, for the catacombs, too, so that's nice. All right. That's, that's cool, I guess. How long does this take? Oh, four hours. <laughs> All right. So, um, I guess that's it for now. Uh, first initial thoughts. I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing where this takes us because, again, this is a little bit different than it's a sci-fi kind of Halloween event, but I'm not too bothered by it like some people. At least it has Halloween theming, unlike the movie version last year. So I'll give it that. I'm looking forward to seeing how well this turns out. And apparently this basically was like years in the making. Aliens came down because of because of this thing. My guess is going to be. And uh, who knows if November is going to be the a conclusion of that. But uh, yeah, I guess we'll have to wait and see. This whole event led up to this moment. Aliens. <laughs> God, I didn't even think that I would start the whole video off with the aliens joke but uh, there we go there we are 
Right, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do one more clip, which is basically continuing with the story, and then I'm going to end it there because I still have to wait for some stuff, which you probably already saw right now. So, yeah, I won't conclude this just yet, but next clip will be the last one, most likely. So, yeah, initial thoughts. Looking forward to it. Uh, it looks exciting. And I'm kind of curious to see what this new feature is going to be added. Because apparently he said it's going to be big. And uh, I think this is what he was talking about. So, new land maybe? New area? I don't know. I guess we'll find out sooner or later. I just opened the box. <laughs> A normal one. And I got the turtle black skin for uh, Ekabog here. So let's take a look at it. I don't think... Yeah, no, it doesn't come with any animation. That's the bloom one. Yeah, so this is what I got. And just to see... Yeah, unfortunately it does not. So it's just the uh, cherry blom thing. Alright, cool. Coolie beans. I guess I shall return once the uh, quest is done. Be back. I don't know why I ended it, because I literally was just right there. <laughs> I just needed to uh, get this from, uh, you know, thing. So let's just do it. See what happens now. Pop, did you plan some kind of flying machine as a Halloween stunt? I set up a pit trap for trick-or-treaters, but no aerial vehicles. Hmm. Why you ask? Well, if the spooky music has anything to do with it, I feel like something's gonna happen. Some alien spaceships are emerging from the clouds. That's all. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, then that's fine then. They look like... Uh... Giant flying pumpkins? And they're heading straight towards us! Flying pumpkins? Oh no! They're trick-or-treaters coming out for revenge! Yeah, there you go. And they look just like that, by the way. Oh nice, we got the squashed person. Fantastic. And we got lurches already. But, uh, oops. That's, uh, hold, what, what do I need again? Oh, I do need the... God, I need a bunch of stuff. Where's the thing? Hi, buddy. Sorry. You're not done yet. You gotta keep on dancing for me. Keep on dancing until I tell you to. You're gonna dance for me forever. Open up some pumpkin boxes. Fantastic. Got some stuff. All right, anyways. Man, we're just upgrade. That's the thing. When the first few levels, it's like, ah, well, look at the progression we've made. But as soon as we hit to, like, some point in the mid middle of the event, it's like, ah, force stop. Anywho. The hatch of the alien command ship is opening. Be on guard, everybody. Oh, are we going to finally get to see that alien thing that we probably got teased in the beginning? I think so. Earthlings, I am the Space Emperor. This planet's candy is now mine. Oh my god, this is so reminding me of Attack of the jack o lanterns now. More candy! Yes, more candy! Go to houses and get more candy! Like anyone's going to listen to some space pumpkin. Not to mention, I have a lot of questions now. Like, for example, why are you pumpkins? Were were you species from here? Like, lots of questions that have to be answered. Resistance is futile. Prepare to submit, or we'll destroy you. I only hope that I did this guy's voice justice. That's my hope, anyways. But I guess we'll have to wait and see. All your candy belongs to us. <laughs> Ooh. All your base, all your base, all belong to us. Oh no, why am I reminded of that song? You know, this one. That's an old one. Alright, obtain cosmic lollipops. Oh, ooh, mmm, god damn, darn. Why didn't I not do that? Oh well, can I get any? Oh, I got that, but unfortunately no. Actually, when do I get more of these? Uh, I get more here. God. Ah. <sighs> I guess we'll find out what comes up first next, huh? But first things first, I need to get me some wands. Some wands, some capes, which, thanks, speaking of, thank you, I just reminded myself. Need capes. I need two of them, right? Yeah, I do. God, this is going to be a little bit of an interesting challenge just to try to get me to 
figure out what to do. Like the first week is going to be hard, but as soon as I invest into this game, it's like, ah, it's going to be easy to get out everything you watch. But yeah, for the first few, it's just going to be like, ooh, <laughs> ooh boy. But uh, yeah, should be fine. Actually, it's nice that we're going to get need four instead of the five. Usually it's five, but uh, yeah, no, it's just four. All right, well, that seems to be the plan, Stan. Actually, just to make sure of something. I just wanted to look into assimilation, which I just did, and uh, nothing yet. But you probably already saw it through this video because I'm just I'm just that nice of a guy. But during the recording of this, which is just the first day, nothing yet. Nothing yet. So, Halloween has begun. And it seems as though things are getting a little bit more interesting as far as this mansion stuff goes. So, that's the question. What do you think so far? What do you think? <laughs> do you think we're going to get through this okay? Man, if only I waited, but I didn't. So I guess we're going to end this with my Kuro army. Alright, I guess I'm going to call this one an episode. So, uh, see you soon. I don't want to lose all my candy. This can't be happening. Oh, it's happening, Pugsley. Also, hi. Uh, I accidentally uh, clicked um, the candy bucket without realizing. Oops. Don't panic, Pugsley. We're not gonna let a gang of space punks push us around. Yeah, you tell them, Wednesday. They didn't reckon on facing what the atoms can throw at them. Yeah, the atoms are probably the worst people to go after. Just follow my commands, and we can repel these aliens. Again, one of my questions is, why do they look like that, and why do they need candy? Again, it, it does something I want to think about, right? By the way, it gets stuff that we don't really need. Don't know why, but, you know, there you go. Alright, put this down. Yay, more of this. More candy! You know, I can't help it. Alright, so we're done with that. So we can do this. What do you mean? There you go. Good. So now let's do the flag. Stop freaking out. Thank you. Calm down. I'm not done yet. Uh... And, uh, I figured, you know what, I know I said I was going to end this part one, like, you know, last, uh, last clip, but I'm like, you know what, a little bit, a little bit longer. This, this part, and then it'll end, okay? Just, just let me have this, alright? Don't worry, it's, it's going to happen. But anyways, yeah, alright, let's see what comes up next. Let's see what her Wednesday's plan is. What's the plan to fight the aliens Wednesday? Nice sci-fi costume. Grandma, hit him with the bitter blizzard. Pumpkins can't survive a frost. Wow, you're referring to the first ever update this year? Oh, okay. When the winter, heed my call. Freeze these infernal space creatures. <laughs> what, a, what, what a great way to use reuse assets, eh? Maybe I should have had Grandma look like that, but oh well. It's... Uh, it's working! Oh, the ships are crashing to the ground, frozen solid. I wonder if their space suits refers to something. They might, but I can't for the life of me remember what they might be looking for. Yeah. But there are more of them coming. Let's prepare our next attack. Tango Dilla Squash. Wow, and when I say the music's still epic, obtain spooky bombs, place the crash meteor site. Uh, I mean, I need to still do that. <sighs> I know I'm going to need to get this, but I want to get the craft stuff first. I want to get this. St you know what? Fine. Fine. You can have one. Just one. <laughs> okay. All right. So, yeah, that's it. The alien discovery thing. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to this. I know a lot of people might be kind of... Some of them are disappointed. When it's like, oh, it's not spooky. But, you know, 
Oh, I mean, it's spooky. I mean, it's Halloween stuff. So, again, much... Oh, hi, bro. <laughs> much better than the last event. A hundred percent. Right. Now this will end part one. So, and I also double-checked. Um, there is no update for assimilation as far as the, you know, preview goes. So, yeah, it's going to leave it a blank. But there was a preview for the... Um, the mansion, which I did showcase in this episode, neck, mind you, was like the day in the after, but whatever. Anywho, I hopefully you enjoy what is to come. I don't know how many parts, if it's going to be a three-parter or maybe a four-parter. Who who knows? But I guess in the end of the day, you'll find out. But I shall see you in part two. So let's get this going. And I wonder if we are going to get a bundle this month, or I mean this week. Huh, I guess we'll find out, eventually. Isn't that right, pumpkins? Evil, evil pumpkins. And with that, we'll end part one to this space adventure. Will the family end up getting the aliens off their track? Will the Emperor succeed in their candy ventures? We will all have to win the sea. In fact, why are they even here? Why, why do they need candy? Maybe all these answers and more will be answered next video. I don't know. I guess we'll have to wait and see. Also, we might even get to know exactly what special feature might be popping in. Maybe the Adams won't be alone in the fight against the aliens? Maybe. All this and more next time. I've been Grim and I'll be seeing you next time for this Halloween 2022 event, Adam Aliens Attack. Until then, get your spacesuits ready and prepare for the ins invasion. <laughs>